What's up guys? Today we are watching episode 7 of Wolfpack. So last episode we actually found out a bit. Like, we found out that Cyrus's dad didn't actually die in a fire, but he died by a wolf. And we found out that the wolf, like, here now, is not, like, Harlan and Luna's father. It's actually a teenage boy that we saw, well, that Everett saw, and, like, no one else did. It was so weird. Like, I didn't know that there would be a different one, but now I'm getting confused. But that's besides the point. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about now. Like, I know that they're, that this is a totally different wolf. But we found that out from Malcolm last episode, which played by Gideon Emery. I fucking loved that. And not even that, not only that, but I, I forgot her name. The blonde girl who just made up with Blake, she died from the wolf. And that's kind of scary. I didn't expect them to actually like show all that kind of blood shit, but they did. And it was kind of weird, but also kind of cool. But I want to find out more about this wolf and everything. So I guess let's get into the episode. <laughs> Does anyone actually sleep in the middle of the bed? Because I sleep like on the left side, but he's straight up in the middle. I tried doing middle before, but it was weird. I know who you are. So now you're having creepy visions about this dude. Your name is... Yeah, so he's not actually there, but he thought he was. Okay. But it's like, why would the dude randomly just be in your room at night? You thought you would have heard something way sooner? Is it a side effect of his meds? Wait, no. Because I was remembering what his dad was talking about last episode. But I don't think it would be. Unless it's just the moon or something. He's straight up bare naked. That was like some hellhound type of shit. Why were you on fire? I wouldn't go out that door. Cause something's gonna be waiting for you. I don't like how that looked like it was mm, the effects or whatever I didn't like it I wouldn't do this <laughs> it is so weird how it takes over like that like he doesn't want to do it but he can't control it but then that's like some typical werewolf shit, you know? But the way he's explaining it, it kind of seems like it's... Everett. And he just saw a body. Not if you make him angry. Not if he doesn't like you anymore. So he was angry at first, and then he wasn't? This seems like some inner banshee kind of shit. 
But it's like, he did, no one knows that she died yet besides other dude. So... That felt like the longest opening scene ever. That was literally like 10 minutes of like one scene. Man, stayed up all night. Well, actually technically not because he fell asleep on the desk, but He's thinking about how he was probably going to have to shoot Harlan and them if they didn't calm down. That is so sad. They lucky they grew. I stopped growing by like <laughs> maybe ninth grade. Harlan, Luna, guys, wait. They didn't want to talk about it. Late for school. Did you need to talk to Harlan? I did. But I'll settle for you. We still haven't gotten an explanation as to what she knows, how she knows it, or whatever. Lab text found it on the ground. I actually thought it was a silver bullet at first. It's not? Oh. You won't need a lawyer. I promise. But I'll protect him as if he was one of my own. Why? Why would you do that for that man? I know y'all are like somewhat teammates in a way, but also you're not. Y'all kind of seem like friends, but also not friends. So what do you gain? Or maybe you just don't care. I don't know. And you close the door behind you and you don't open for anyone except me or Blake. 10 minutes. Please, nothing happened within these 10 minutes. And where is Blake? Unless she already left for school. And someone broke into the room. Who would want to break into their room? The wolf? I feel like it has no reason to. Blake? Whose body is in there? He was here. She was below him on the stairs, right here. You can't just skip over it like that. Hiding? Hiding? Yeah, he was fucking scary. If you woke up with a naked guy in your room, you wouldn't be scared? No. True. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Okay. But it's reasonable for why he did. I change him back. But if he kills Austin tonight, it's because of us. Sure, it's gonna be. How do they know he's going after Austin? Playing on the piano. Austin's next. I don't care how much of a dick he is. We have to do something. Hmm. What does? So you want to hunt down and catch a werewolf? Yeah. What else are you gonna do? I'm not trying to help the dude in a way. So, 
the wolf brought the girl's body to Blake's motel thing to try and frame her in a way like how why I have to go back to the motel we're moving into some shitty apartment today I didn't expect them to already be kissing like are y'all together now is that the girl you like yeah are you sure she's your type? She seems a bit rugged. You don't know my type. Okay, well... Why are you straight up judging her already? I'm sure there's a zombie that has to get shot in the head. I or... don't play video games anymore. I'm taking the car, Mom. I'll have it back in a Go little while. Go to your while. room. Why is she straight up just dismissing him? Nice to you. You should be nice to me. I am nice to you. You're not. Since when? You never were. Was that so hard though? Like, you act like he was about to go do something bad. I don't like his mom. She calmed him down. What the fuck happened? What did you do? I didn't do shit, Danny. You found the body in the bathroom. What body? She doesn't know it's the other girl yet. I'll be a werewolf. I wouldn't count on all of the myths. Then how did you know it would work? I guessed. But you guessed right. It was something I read online. It's not always guessing. Like, he was taking a chance, hoping that he wouldn't have to go through with shooting them. Where are you going? Find your brother. Harlan. I think it's kind of ass that he's, like, not talking about the other one. But it's like, if he has more... He Harlan's a priority right now, so I guess... It's reasonable. Why bring Phoebe here? I don't know. But I'm gonna find Harlan and we're gonna figure out what to do. So now there's two people looking for Harlan. Who's gonna find him first? I remember. Yeah, from the parking lot. No. From the parking garage. No, the lot. She was at the parking garage? appointed lawyer will you be paying for one yourself oh look at that Blake she's just like you goes right for the throat I thought he was about to have like a different kind of insult and I was about to be I was about to be like what the fuck man I believe you you're not gonna believe me I think I might surprise you on that subject both of you if he thinks that she's from the parking garage was she the other wolf that was there that took him? So you want to kill the werewolf? Yeah. Wait for it to turn human. Uh-huh. Then bring it back to life? We're not really bringing the werewolf. How would that even work? That doesn't even seem like it would work. Harlan. We're gonna get him out. Baron? No. Cyrus. We all know he didn't do it. He's comforting them about it. Their friendship is blossoming. But how are we gonna get him inside? You wanna use Austin as bait? Baron's gonna kill him anyway. Oh, I thought they were gonna use Luna as bait, but I was gonna be like, how would that even work? Thanks for coming with me. I know we've been to this place more than once. Was headed out to find Harlan? not answering my calls. Is she about to show him something or like admit to something? Please do. So if we miss something, this is most likely where we're gonna find it.
What is she about to do? Don't tell me you want to try and kill him. Well, I know you've had a crush on me. <sighs> but do you actually like me? I meant... Um... I didn't know that he would actually bring this up. Yes. Yes, I like you. No, you don't. How are you to tell her, no, you don't? You like me a little less than sometimes? That's your own problem since you're a bitch sometimes. What's the plan? Man, I thought we were gonna get a kiss. Use it only if you have to. If everything goes to shit. What a, I don't know why I was about to say, what if he ends up using it on his self, like... Three vials of epinephrine. How come you never So that's how they're gonna get the freaking epinephrine, the dude that Cyrus don't like. To be honest, seeing you with Harlan and Luna makes me realize that my son could have used a father like you. You did notice my kids aren't speaking to me. That's... that's a sweet thing to admit. Hmm. Is she the one that set the fire or whatever that killed her husband and her kid? Or wait, did they not just say that it wasn't a fire? They just died together. I just assumed it was on a fire. Would it have been her? Oh wait, no, I should be tripping. Dude didn't get to this part of the story. He left it out. Wait, so he knows. <laughs> Shit, okay. So it was her. So that means that she killed Cyrus's dad. Ramsey. Is this the one? So she can transform. So I wait. So she, is she the other werewolf that they were talking about? Because it, apparently there's another one, and so it's it's got to be her. There's something down there. What's that sound? Don't you dare try and kill her. I mean him. They're coming. You ready? Oh wait, they're all there at the same time because other dude, dude and the lady are there, right? That's the same place. It works, okay? 
Give me a fucking break. It was cute though. Okay, this is good. I feel incredibly vulnerable and completely exposed. Perfect. <laughs> Like me. Sorry. It's so weird that he knows now. It's not your default setting. So all I had to do to get you to like me was be the bait for a werewolf that's probably gonna kill me. She just liked you this whole time, what you mean? That kind of seemed like it would be a Derek and Kate moment from like Teen Wolf, like their history kind of thing. Cause you know, she's a werewolf, he don't know. Mm. No one knows and no one has to know. What if they did? I'd lose them. I can't lose my kids. Don't tell her, even though she already knows in a way. Was it a person that did this? Yes. And no. It's like she knows, but also not. It's an, it's so weird because he know he doesn't know that she knows. Mmm, I hate this. So it's definitely the other one since the lady is with our dude. Threat. Okay, what do I do? Threaten you? Hit me. What? I need you to hit me. Oh no, he ain't gonna do that. Even though he sound he seems like a bitch, he ain't gonna do that. That's when we get our kiss. He's not gonna come after you still. Or he is. Run! So how did that, how does that work? All she did was slap him and she, he, the thing still wasn't going after him and then he kisses her and then he will like. It's gonna be her. Oh no. Okay, it's gonna be Blake. I thought it was gonna be Luna. Guys, that's right fucking behind me. I feel like she shouldn't have said anything because can't he hear? Ever just got whacked. Baron. Baron. How does that even work? It's uh, uh, they're not separated. That was so weird how that worked. In a way. How is that glass holding? It did it that quick? Are you kidding me? I got it right here. Ah! Ah! 
That didn't look like no other shot. That's a knife. I am confused. How? Okay. So, we know Lady was the one in the fire a long time ago with Cyrus's dad and them, you know, Malcolm. Why is she trying to help this wolf? Like, that's Luna and Harlan's brother. Why is she trying to help? Like, I'm kind of, I'm kind of confused to that, like, about that. Like, mmm, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like, it seems like she's on our team, but then not. But then, all, mm, I just don't understand sometimes. She's like switching back and forth and I don't know why. Like, she seems like she was about to freaking kill our dude. And he better not end up dying. Because I will quit. It's in like next episode, the last episode of the season two. So it's like... If that's how the season is going to end, I'm quitting that show. I'm quitting it. But it's just like she's switching back and forth and I I don't know how it's working. And it's like, how are we, we're never able to really tell which one's doing what. Because it's like sometimes the wolf in the scene will be her or the other kid and you never know when. Ugh. It's so confusing with them too. But it's like, I, I didn't expect for this plan to work. The logistics of it doesn't seem, it didn't seem like too good of a plan, but also it was a good plan. I don't know, it was just like some parts, it's like if one little thing messes up then the whole plan could have been fucked, but it was fine. They caught Jude. I was just, I was just kind of confused as to why, like how it happened that quick. Like, how did it slow his heart rate down and everything that quick? I thought it had to, like, stay in there for way longer than that. But they caught him, so now they're going to try and help him. So now the only thing, like, the only threat we have is the lady. And, you know, it's like, what if Malcolm recognized her? I don't think he would because like in the scene you can't really see her face that much like you could barely even tell it was her until like that shot of her laying on the ground and everything but it was so weird like it it kind of had me question if like he knew about it or not but I guess not but it's still so weird like his story in a way didn't line up yeah, his story in a way didn't line up because I don't think he, he didn't mention that part at all. Unless he thought it was like flipped around and it was actually like the male. Yeah, he was saying that the male came after them for killing the uh, mate, I guess. See, their stories aren't lining up. Or maybe I'm just taking it in a different way and I actually didn't remember it right. I don't know. I thought it was the other way. But it's still so freaking confusing, but I just want to know what's going to happen with all this shit. I want to see if my dude dies. Hopefully not. I just want to see how this is all going to play through, especially whenever she reveals that she's a wolf. So I guess come back for episode eight. <laughs>